What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to Broken Boat Garage. Hope you guys stay tuned to this full video. Uh, we're going to be priming the inner fenders with filler primer. It's over, actually over here if you want to get a look at that, Morgan. What do you think about this primer? You think it's kind of good looking? It's 2253, so it's your pool filler primer. But obviously, we would do the inner fenders, the hood hinge, the hood, the tailgate. And after all this is done, that's probably the only primer these are going to get. That's a direct to metal, and like it's a direct to metal primer, too. That's what it says. So uh, we'll probably get all this primed and then after it cures, take it down and probably honestly prime the other fenders, the other hood hinge, and the bottom of the hood. And then we're gonna start laying paint soon. So we got black sand and all that. But yeah, what's, uh, what, I already stirred it once. Let us wipe some more of the stuff down, get that inner fender hung back up because I had to clean it again because it got dirty. And we'll uh, start spraying some stuff down. What's going on guys? So we're mixing it up. This is a four to one ratio. I'm just gonna stir this up a lot. Got that fan going, got us a light going. Should turn out pretty good. But try to mix this up the best you guys can if you guys do this. Mix that up too before, you know, obviously. Right, Morgan? Yeah. I like this. That seems pretty good. I like how that comes out. We're gonna give it a half hour and then do one more coat, but everything's looking pretty decent. We got some things on the hood that I don't like. Would you see those one things out, Morgan? I think it's shooting too much. My pressure might be too much. Mm -hmm. But yeah. And it's all for that. Hopefully that ain't water or something. Well, I get that figured out. Tailgate looks pretty good. I still didn't get my body like perfect down here, but that's all right. It's a lot better than what it was. Yep, half hour we we'll put a second coat on. I'll do that and then we'll start uh, sanding on it tomorrow. So I'll see you guys uh, tomorrow. Some more over here. Oh my gosh. Damn. Good thing I cut that camera. That just dropped. But we got that primed. <laughs> Hopefully we didn't mess it up. How did that break? Oh wow. All right, well, we know we can't leave them hanging that long. So anyway. The hood gets two coats on it now. Uh, all this stuff will sand out the first sandpaper I use, and then we'll go on from uh, to using different grits. Sand that all out. Hopefully we only have to prime little sections now before painting. But main goal now is to get those fenders primed and the other hood hinge and the bottom of the hood. So I'm just moving things around. Also did the gas tank door yesterday, which is I'll show you guys this in the light and show you guys the tailgate and uh, inner fenders. It's looking pretty good. Those are how those turned out. These are pretty much ready for paint. Just need uh, a little bit of sand and done to them. And that's the tailgate. Pretty happy with it so far. I figured it'd be, we'll have some paint down in the next uh, week or so. 
All right, guys, so I'm gonna get some uh, primer mixed up and start spraying these, got these painted. I gotta have to use the ladder to paint that one, but hell yeah, let's get this done. Uh, and then we'll start black sand, and I'll probably black sand uh, the hood in this video. But I'm liking the progress so far. Well guys, uh, it didn't turn out too bad. A couple spots that uh, I should have probably got better, but I was having some paint problems with the gun. This should be good enough for now. As you guys can see, there's a high there. That's all stuff that's gonna be, have to get figured out. There's a couple dents right there. There's a couple dents on that one. This came out pretty good for what it is. Now, uh, what I'm going to do for the fenders is I'm going to actually put them on the truck to block stand them and stuff. So I'm just going to set those over there for now. Finish up uh, messing with all this stuff. Sand it up, get it ready for paint. And then uh, those will probably get painted after all this because we got to take the truck apart to be able to put those fenders on it. But yeah, let me clean up and we'll start uh, sanding on the hood or the tailgate, one of the two. All right, guys, so here we go. We're working on the tailgate. What I'm going to do is see how that's like has all those little things in it. This is like real smooth now. So I'm just taking all that out now. Like how you can see all the little dots. And it looks like it's like, I don't even know how to explain it. Like a texture to it. Taking all the texture off it. And then I'm gonna go through all the different grits of sandpaper that was recommended. And uh, hopefully it looks good after we paint it. And pretty much try to find any lows that we missed. Probably not too particular with the tailgate, but the other stuff, yes. Uh, any highs knock them out and if we get a spot where we went through we're not going to apply the whole thing again we're just going to spot prime it from here on out but not too long until this is actually uh painted so i'm going to take all the texture out of this and then i'll get back to you guys after i start doing the uh actual different grits of sandpaper and going on from there so guys so uh the tailgate if you want to show them the tailgate wagon has quite a few spots that's burning through on it my fault i'm trying to learn how to do this as i go but uh, we're gonna just do the hood for this video and then probably end it. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put this guide coat on it. That's kind of a lot, but let's spread that around. Only on the big part right now, I work on one section at a time. That's a lot of guide coat. I gotta get this spray stuff to be a lot better. But then I'm gonna hit all this with uh, 220, go up to 320, and then uh, What's my other one that I have? Uh, I think it's like 400 or 600. And now I'm gonna wet sand that. But yeah, let's get all this. Uh, what would you call this, Morgan? That's how you can like see that it's like in it. You do what now? Like what would you call that? Texture. Yeah. Get all the texture off real quick with the 220. And then we go with the 300. And then the 400, like I keep saying. I don't like this guide coat at all. That's way too much. It should not be like that. I don't know if I'm putting it on wrong or what, but I have to find out. Should serve its purpose, purpose though, right? Yeah, hopefully. Hopefully we don't burn through no spots except the one that I'm expecting to. So that way we don't have to find the whole hood again. That should be good. Let's get that all block sanded. With this 220. I'm gonna start from back there. Go with my way back. It's gonna be a miracle if the truck comes out decent because it's just one idiot with a couple buddies. Me and Morgan in the garage just trying to make it look good. You think it's gonna be a miracle, Morgan? Oh, my buddy. I said Morgan. 
I said a couple of buddies in the clutch. But here we go. Alright, so uh so far it's feeling pretty smooth. I'm gonna blow this off soon and see what we got going on under it. What do you think, Morgan? Oh, oh yeah. I almost spent a lot of time doing this. <laughs> All right, we're gonna watch yourself. We're gonna shut the camera off real quick while I blow this off, so we don't go get hit with it. All right, so as you guys can see, we blew it off, and these are kind of like higher spots. The darker spots are kind of lower, but we'll just stay with it. There's a really low, low, low spot over here. I'm just gonna keep going down this edge with this round block. And if anyone sees I'm doing something wrong, let me know in the comments. <laughs> First time doing something like this. But honestly, I think we're going to come out pretty decent. You think, Morgan? Mm -hmm. I keep asking Morgan because I'm so nervous and saying it to you guys, but I think we'll wind up getting it. At least a lot better than what it was. Mm -hmm. This is gonna take me a lot of time and I'm not gonna be able to film all this stuff because I don't always have someone to help me film and honestly you'll probably just get this hood all block sanded so you guys can see it and I'll see if I'm gonna spray it again with primer or not and then uh end this video I'll finish this other stuff next video we make is probably paint some of this stuff but don't worry there's plenty of stuff that you guys will see in the truck I still don't know what I'm doing with that Mustang engine. Haven't decided decided yet, made up my mind. So we waiting on that. I'll blow that off real quick. I'll try not to hit no one. I'm actually gonna stay away from that now. I'll work right here. Well, you know, this is this side's coming out pretty decent. This side's gonna need a little bit of work right there. That's the spot I think we're gonna have to definitely refine. Alright, so we almost went through a whole gallon of that filler primer on this stuff. So we're probably gonna need one to two more gallons to see later. Well, it's really ain't too bad. And that's why I went to that one instead of the Easter one, because the Easter is $200 a gallon. That one's only a hundred, hundred or five dollars I paid for that shipped to the house. We didn't even have to drive to get it. How far is the Eastwood from here? Like 45 minutes? Yeah, I was, so that takes a lot of time. I'm actually going to leave that alone now until we get 320 on it. And just, uh, I'm going to try to, I should have did the smaller sections. But I'm going to work in this section now. Over here. Just work my way out. Oh no. We're gonna start a time lapse now. I'm going in for the night, but uh, this is gonna be the end of this video actually because it's getting pretty long. It's like 15 minutes long. Hopefully, you guys watch to the end. Uh, this section's all done. I actually started waxing the net just to see what would happen, but I'm just messing around kind of. Uh, this few lows on this side I'm going to have to fix. That's good. 
That seems good. That seems good. Pretty sure that's going to be good. So we just got to fix in the middle and right there. But other than that, uh, the next video you guys will see is probably a little more block standing. And then uh, we'll probably be putting some paint on in that video, hopefully. Or you might not even see the block standing. Might just block sand all this and go from there. But please like, comment, subscribe. Stay tuned for more. See you guys for the next one.